What's going on guys? Welcome to part two of integrating DJI mic into my current system. Um, before I start using the system, of course, I want to do firmware updates and that's just with about any electronic device that you have, own, buy. <laughs> um, of course, depending when you buy something, it's always gonna be either out of date for either firmware or software. So this is why we go through these things so that we have the best user experience whenever we're using the device and just to make sure that any bugs or things like that are already taken care of. So we don't have to worry about having to take care of any issues as we're using the system. So if you own DJI products or even anything, new phone, things like that, Apple, Android, it does require a software update or occasional firmware update. So just a quick and easy, probably a five or 10 minute video. We'll just go over to, of course, DJI's website because we are using DJI's mic system. Go over to the support tab, hover above support, and then you go to their download section. So this will also bring up all the other apps and assistance that are available for the drones, uh, goggles, and other systems like the Ronin or transmission systems. But we'll go down to products or you can search it. We can just type in search and do mic and then it should be there. And then you'll have all your digital manuals in all your different languages. And then you'll have at the bottom firmware updates. Um, so there is gonna be one for the receiver and then one for the transmitter. They're two separate updates, make sure you do them and make sure you do the transmitters, uh, both transmitters. And then if you're still having issues, there's always this little text guide that will show you pretty much how I'm showing you, but in text form. So we'll go ahead and download the receiver and then also download the transmitter uh, firmware update. So this will go ahead, uh, it's marked as RX for the receiver and then TX has your transmitter. And then we'll go ahead and go into our regular um, our regular the regular hard drive thing. So this is where it's gonna show up. Um, one thing I love about the DJI mics is that they just show up as a regular device. When you plug it in, you don't have to worry about having a downloaded software. So first thing we'll do is go ahead and plug in the receiver. You'll hear the little audio chime go off and then you see that it came up as a another hard drive. It's pretty much its own little like SD card type of thing. And then you'll go ahead and click on the mic or the hard drive thing that it came up as. So we'll go ahead and click on that. Now that we have that there, this is gonna be the DJI transmitter and this is gonna be your basic root file. You don't have to worry about anything else on that. You'll go ahead and go to your downloads. Oops, let me close that for now. You go to your downloads, Chrome downloads, and then we have the DJI receiver. So we'll go ahead and do that firmware update. We'll just drag put this to the side. Put that to the side and then you'll have so we have the receiver, we want to transfer that to the receiver. And then it'll take some time to transfer that file over. And then as soon as you unplug it from the computer, it will start doing the download on its own. So we'll, we'll wait for this to finish copying over. There, now it's on there. So I'll go ahead and unplug this. Let's see, close. And then back here. And then as you can see, it'll start updating on its own. And then we'll go ahead and plug in the transmitters. So pretty much the same process with this. You'll go ahead and go to your download section and then You'll go into the DJI mic. There we go. Uh, so that is a test audio that I did earlier, but let's see, we'll do this one, go back to our downloads, and then we'll go to the receiver. Oh, sorry, transmitter. So download this one, drag and drop it into there. Then you're good to go. And then as soon as you unplug it, it'll start doing its download. So you want to do that for both transmitters that you have. So 
you'll see the, the lights and everything that will start flashing on the transmitter and then as you are turning on the receiver then you'll get the you'll get it on screen as well showing you that there's a firmware update being done that's going to be pretty much it you can also look through the uh, release notes of what the firmware update is going to pretty much have and then it'll tell you pretty much what it adds in terms of the user interface and any settings or software. But that's the quick and easy way to do the software updates, firmware updates for your DJI mic. Thanks guys, see you later.